Hey, welcome back to episode four of the City Spotlight. My name is Calvin, I'm a local realtor, and this series was created to help you choose the best city when moving to the San Gabriel Valley. And today we have Alhambra. We're now in Alhambra, California, known as the gateway city to the San Gabriel Valley because it's one of the furthest west cities known in the San Gabriel Valley. Uh, we're about 10, probably 10, 15 minutes max to Los Angeles. If you look at it on the map here, we're extremely close. And that's why it's known as the gateway city because it is the first city you're gonna reach um, coming into San Gabriel Valley. Uh, also, if you can notice in the background, we're on top of a parking structure and we're overlooking Main Street. The way Alhambra is set up, Main Street is the main focus of Alhambra. I mean, everything's here. We have Regal Cinema, uh, we have City Hall, we have all the restaurants that you'll see. We have car dealerships, Fossil Men's Ice Cream, 99 Ranch, Costco, Aldi, Target, anything you name it in Alhambra, it's here on Main Street. Uh, we're also gonna take a tour around and take a look at Main Street, so um, come join me. As we walk down Main Street, let's talk a little bit about the real estate, what it costs to live here, and how much the median price is. So townhomes and condos, that's mostly located around uh, Main Street and two, three minutes away from Main Street. If you're looking for a two bed, it's about 598,000. A three bed, 681,500. HOAs typically cost between 200 and $350 a month. And the one unique thing about Alhambra is that there are a few senior living 55 and 65 plus living areas for seniors so it's cool plus if you're looking for a single family residence something of your own space you're going to be looking for mostly mid-century homes meaning homes built between 1940 and 1960. looking at the overall city you'll find single family residents mostly north and south of main street which we call downtown alhambra uh, a two bed will typically run you about 889 889,000 and a three bed, about 947,000. Walking further down Main Street, you'll notice there's a lot of big department stores, but there's also a lot of small local stores, like this shop here, owned by one of my good friends, Vintage Hype. They have a lot of vintage, vintage clothing. If you're into that stuff, definitely have to check this place out. Now we're just about two minutes north of Main Street, right off downtown Alhambra. One of the condos here, like I said, all the condos and townhomes are really located just a few minutes outside of Main Street. Here's one of them. Come on in and take a look. This is one of the new listings that just hit the market, priced at 629,000. This is a three bed, two full bath. 1135 square feet it is a condo located around the story park neighborhood just north of main street it is 300 dollars a month for hoa a look at that beautiful condo right off main street about five ten minutes away is almanzar park so let's get over there and take a look at that as well we're here now at almanzar park the biggest park in alhambra and also the san gabriel valley and in and in my book it's a top three park for sure in the san gabriel valley and let me tell you why i have a good list here um first there's an 18 hole golf course a driving green a driving range and also a putting green I'm in the Almanzar Park area. There's also the Almanzar Grill. If you're feeling a few bites, four and a half stars on Yelp. Um, the actual park features a few lakes. Although you can't fish, there are a lot of ducks that they say not to feed, but everyone feeds them bread anyways. Uh, the park also features a gymnasium, an indoor gym for open basketball, um, volleyball, badminton, and also table tennis. There's also outdoor courts, about five or six of them with lights that light up all the way into I think it's 11 p.m. There's a 1.1 mile paved loop route that I'll show you, should be up on the screen now. 
and a ton of open space for dogs, soccer, or you know any recreational sport that you like. It's a really friendly family park, and you'll find it really busy, especially after dinner, 7, 8, 9 p.m. It gets pretty packed here. A lot of people walk the dinner off, and uh, just get some exercise and get out, out of the house, especially with uh, everything's been happening these past years. Um, this is a great place to be. Very family friendly, very safe, very bright and well lit. So definitely recommend it. Now moving a little bit away from Main Street, like I said, most of the townhomes and condos will be located around Main Street. You'll find a little bit more single family residences a little bit away from them. So we're about 15, 20 minutes away from Main Street. Check out this one, priced slightly higher than the average of single families here in Alhambra, but take a look. This property is listed at 1.162 million. It features four beds, three full baths, 2,236 square feet of living space, and a 5,742 square foot lot, built in 1985. Thank you so much for joining me on episode four of the City Spotlight, where we covered Alhambra, California. If you or any of your family members are ever looking to relocate to the San Gabriel Valley, Los Angeles area, or even just Southern California, I would love the opportunity to help you guys out. Feel free to contact me through text, call, or even slide in my DMs. All my information is here below, and I will see you guys on the next one.